I can do that. I was trying so hard to be nice tonight. You are being nice. that I do that, I'm talking so much. Okay, so, um, <laughs> no, really, I, I know I only have 15 minutes, so I'm gonna, I'm actually, I'm gonna close out this poem because it, it tends to get drawn out. Every time I do this poem, y'all do that rewind business and all that. It's way longer than it has to be, so. It is for the women. It is. It definitely is for the women. Um, eventually, I shall retire this poem. However, that day is not today. That day is not today. So, um, this poem is called, I Hope Failure Finds You. I know I can't go anywhere. Like, you know how something, like, you can just get, like, a you. Like as a kid, I was like the kid who picked up boogers all the time. Like I was known, like picking boogers for me was like a sport. Like I was the booger pick picker. I wanted to pick other people's boogers. You know? like, so I, I mean, I was a cowboy. Okay, that's what I did. Come on, come on. So this is my this is the poem that follows me. Like my reputation for picking boogers when I was eight. <laughs> Alright, so this one was all I hope very fun, you. And I hope y'all enjoy it. <laughs> oh boy! <laughs> so, I have never wished failure on anyone. But there's always an exception to the rule. So I hope failure finds you in everything you do. I wish I could watch you getting humiliated on every TV station in a weekend-long commercial-free marathon hosted by Flavor Flav and Britney. But that's not it. See, I hope you wake up to find your tear ducts seared shut with nothing but time on your hands and onions to cut. I wish you really scary-ass nightmares every time you blink. Then maybe you'll realize what you did wrong. You broke rules even a beginner in the game wouldn't get wrong. See, the hood puts hits on fools like you that put hoes before homies, giving up steak for baloney. I hope you die so old and lonely and wrinkly and constipated. Because you must just play the role of righteous on that conscious tip when you touch the mic to spit. But your character didn't amount to shit. You wasn't gangster enough to walk the walk, so you can't talk the talk. You were conscious MC by default. And your root manners are true far beyond any bonds. Pretend to hold dear, my dear, they say three's a crowd. But what if the third person was blind? You was literally fucking with my mind by avoiding telling the truth. So I hope your wife leads you for a midget with one tooth. <laughs> I wish you pissed pants in public. I wish you tried crack and love it. I wish you found out your spouse is your long lost cousin. I wish you could fire from your job, but from this day forward, no one ever remembers your birthday. And just when you think you hit rock bottom and couldn't possibly have a worse day, I hope the earth falls from beneath your feet. And no one can hear you scream but me. And on that day, I will have smoked the biggest blunt. which is this. Use a bitch. You got engaged after we were dating for 10 months. Then what? Trying to say it was to avoid paying child support. Now, what a piss poor excuse. And I know you teach school, but let me educate you. See, always treat a woman like you want a man to treat your daughter. And speaking of your daughter, I hope she grows up to be a stripper. And you don't find out who you put out your dollar to tip her. Don't return the courtesy. You invaded my space, now this is 
my insurgency because I got a call three days before your wedding day asking for one more late for old time's sake. Talk about icing you tried to have on the cake and eat too, but the evil that we do as humans left you with a soul ruined by stupidly choosing. So I hope your life turns out to be someone else's dream and they wake up the moment you hit the lottery and just for kicks, I wish you bleed from the tip of your dick and it doesn't quit for a week. I wish you Are you active? Like sexually? No. I see the meaning, okay? I'm trying to be active. We get active and we active. Hey, that's your grind. That should be our slogan. Go to the stage. I had to teach her to. Y'all are y'all going to tell the Mellow Monday to make some noise. Well, the ground on the Mellow Monday has been going on before I even got the picture. They usually show the DVD on here of all the, the old Mellow Mondays and stuff. And she used to be one of the poets from the old Mellow Mondays. And um, I'm just glad she's back on the scene. I want y'all to make.